Hey everyone, welcome back to TechMesh. In today's quick tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix the issues where some apps don't work on Wi Fi but work perfectly fine on mobile data. Whether you are using a Samsung phone or any Android device, let's dive right in. So, first, what you need to do is just head over to the settings of your device and turn on the developer option. So, let me do that. So, let's go to the settings of our device. Alright, so to turn on the developer option, you need to go to about phone in the settings option. In about phone, just tap on software information and then tap seven times on the build number. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So here you can see it is saying developer mode has been turned on. So now just go to the developer option. So here in the settings option, you can find the developer option now. So just go to developer option. If you cannot find it, just search in the settings option for developer option, right? You can here search also options. All right. After turning on the developer option here, you need to scroll down and search for Wi-Fi scan throttling. So let me just search for Wi-Fi. Here you can see Wi-Fi scan throttling. So you need to mainly toggle it on. So if it is toggled off for you, you need to toggle it on. And you also need to turn on tethering hardware acceleration. So here you can see tethering hardware acceleration. So just turn it on. All right. So this was the step two. So now what you need to do is you need to reset your network settings. So just go to settings again. And in your settings, you mainly need to here search for reset wi-fi so let's search for reset wi-fi so here you can see the option reset wi-fi and bluetooth settings so just tap on it all right so here you need to mainly tap on reset wi-fi and bluetooth settings so here it is saying this will reset all your bluetooth and wi-fi settings this cannot be undone so if you are agree with that then just tap on reset settings and now your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth will be resetted. So this simple reset can often fix strange Wi-Fi related issues on Samsung or other devices. So now if your problem is still persist, then try this universal next fix. All right. So for the next step, you need to set static IP and change DNS. So for that, go to settings of your device. All right. And then you mainly need to go to the Wi-Fi settings of your device. So here you can also see that I, uh, for Samsung devices, you can find it under connection for other Android device. You might find it under network and internet. So just go to connection and then in your connection, you mainly need to go to the settings of your Wi-Fi. So just tap on Wi-Fi. So here in your Wi-Fi, just let me connect to my Wi-Fi quickly. All right. So we have connected to our Wi-Fi. So here you can see at the side gear icon. So just tap on this gear icon. So now here just tap on view more. So here you can see IP settings. So just tap on IP settings and change DHCP to static. And now here you can see the IP address. So you need to change here a couple of things. First, you need to change the last value of the IP address. So here you can put value from one to 225 you can change the last number between 1 to 225 so let's put this number for example all right so now I scroll down a bit so here you can see dns1 and 2 so for dns1 you mainly need to set 8.8.8.8 so this is google's dns and here in the dns2 you mainly need to here set 4.4.4 .4 .4. So let me just put 4.4.4. .4. After do doing that, just tap on save. So this will force your phone to use Google's DNS, which often helps apps connect more reliably over Wi-Fi. If the problem is still persists with just one app, it might be a corrupt app cache or settings issue. So to fix this app specific issue, you need to mainly go to the settings of your device. So let me just go to the settings of my device here. And then we mainly need to go to apps. So here is the app. So let's go here. So for example, if we are facing the problem with WhatsApp, then we will go to our WhatsApp settings. 
and then here we mainly need to select storage so here you can see storage so just tap on here and then here you mainly need to tap on clear cache and if that doesn't work then try clear data and that's it one of these methods should definitely fix your issues of apps not working on wi-fi if it helped don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for more future videos like this one and comment below if you face a specific app issue and i will try to help you out so i'm mesh from techmesh and i'm signing out